So, I just wanted to give you guys an update. I went to my doctor's appointment today. Um, I am 30, or I'm sorry, <laughs> I'm pushing it. I'm 24 weeks and 5 days. So, um, I went to my ultrasound and I really went in there with thought process of everything's good, the placenta moved, and I'm going to be off bed rest, uh, or well, I'm not on complete bed rest. I just can't leave, like I can go places as long as I'm not like doing too much. Like I can't go off and, I mean I can go to like play the park of the kids, but I have to sit there, like I can't go by myself with the kids. My husband has to go in case something happens. But like, um, I can't work, I can't leave the house by myself. I can't go for walks or anything like that. So, um, I was really hoping that I was going to go to the doctors and they were going to tell me everything's back to normal and your placenta is placed in where it belongs and, um, you have nothing to worry about. But unfortunately it didn't happen that way. Um, so I, the placenta, it, the nice thing is the placenta has not moved. It hasn't gotten any worse, um, but it hasn't moved. So it's still um, hovering a little bit over my cervix. Not completely, like I don't have like the club or complete placenta provera, but um, I am like, it's over the uh, cervix. So she said that I have to come back. I have to go back in five weeks, which will be May 2nd is my next um, ultrasound. And she's very hopeful that it will have moved by then. Um, so I'm crossing my fingers and praying that it moves by then. Because if it doesn't, then I'm going to end up having a C-section. And I know this is my fourth pregnancy, but I have not had a C-section. And I don't want to. Um, I really just, I don't know. I guess it scares the crap out of me. My sister has three kids. Well, she has twins and a boy. So she's been pregnant twice. And both times she had C-sections. And then I, you know, this is my fourth uh, baby and I have yet to have a c-section <laughs> so I'm very nervous about that I'm really hoping that I don't have to have one um, but we'll see uh, whatever is healthiest easiest better like best for baby and I um, as long as he comes out you know when he's supposed to not too early unfortunately we never know with this um, placenta provera Previa. <laughs> um, so we'll see. I'll keep you guys updated. I have another doctor's appointment on Monday or Tuesday. I can't remember. I have appointments like every week between ultrasounds, high risk doctors, regular doctors. I feel like I'm there every week. Um, so I will keep you guys updated and thank you so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying my other videos. I've been trying to keep you guys a little entertained even though I haven't been doing much. But um, with spring break, with the kids on spring break and me not being completely stuck in bed rest, you'll be seeing some videos of us doing a little bit, not too much, like a museum. We go to. Um, a museum in Tampa and then we like there's gonna be a video on um, us going to a bounce house place which is really cool and I can like I said I can go normally when we go to bounce houses I'm like in there with them jumping and bouncing around but um I'm just sitting there <laughs> I can't do anything I'm just gonna be sitting there everywhere we go so, uh, but at least you guys will have something fun to watch, I guess. So, alright guys, thanks again for watching, and I will talk to you guys later.